Okay, y'all. So let me show you a quick little haul. I'm at Minx's house, okay? And I wanted to come and just kind of help her spruce up just a little bit, you know, to make it a little bit more homey. So me and Red came over here and surprised her with a couple things. But I just want to add some curtains. Um, I want to add something over here in this corner. She has a vase downstairs that was oldest daughter's. I think I'm going to try to revamp that vase and, and continue to paint it black. But look, so I found these on my home goods trip. Mean grandma, bad grandma. I know it. But they had these sleeping bags on sale for $15. Look at that. That's so cute. So I got two of them for Noble and Charlie. Um, so I'm gonna give those to them. And then I got these, um, these um, natural uh, little spray things. I'm gonna put those in this corner. So I'm gonna try to revamp a vase. Put that over there with that. Add the curtains. Give her a little coziness in here. And then we have some curtains for the girls' room, the boys' room, and in here. So we got these curtains. All right here, I'm gonna put these ones in the girls' room. In the girls room for those and I think these ones either one either one a pair in here and one pair in the boys room I'm gonna let her decide which ones she want to use maybe she'll use these ones and then put those in the boys room so they're just like sheer with a gray stripe through them I don't know so we have that I have the rods and then I also want to add some flowers to the girl's bunk bed. So I'm gonna add these flowers and I'm going to add this. I added some already, um, but I wanna make it more like a closed in house. So I just got some sheer fabric. I'm gonna put that on their bed, this, those curtains over there and then i just grabbed me some light bulbs for the light we put up yesterday i got her this basket to put some fruit in on her um island in here like in here she's already started painting the top which i think is really cute we're gonna do another coat um, she put some faux contact paper on the island. This darker green is what's going to go on the base of the rest of these cabinets. Ron is going to make another drawer front for this drawer so that that'll be complete. But I thought this would be cute with like some fruit for the kids. They can just walk right up and, you know, get the fruit. We got that and... I think we're going to use that same contact paper on the actual cabinet countertop. So I figured this will be cute in there. Um, just to add a little bit of softness and cozy, you know, to make it nice and cozy and homey. And so I, you know, I just love a good damn little cutting board, y'all. And I found this one. I wanted to keep it for myself, but. I'm not gonna know where I'm gonna give it to you. Look at that. I think it's cute. It's a little vibe. You see it? Okay, don't mind the floors. Kids live here. And so let's just go ahead and put the lights and stuff together and up and all that. But this is what it looks like. We just put some regular bulbs in here to see how it will look on. It's bright. So we're gonna put the correct lights in there and this is the same light we have in the laundry room at the house so these are the bulbs that it takes maybe even the countertop maybe we'll try to help her 
finish this contact paper. It's a quick, retro-friendly, quick solution. If you don't have the money to replace some stuff, just DIY some stuff. Luckily for her, she has a landlord who will let her do it. here in the kitchen to try it out, but we don't have a straight razor to make the cuts pristine. So I just kind of staged it just to see, you know, what it's gonna look like. But this is a quick, inexpensive, easy, renter-friendly DIY. The man man's getting in trouble. So I'm gonna come back tomorrow and finish the rest of this with this and then paint the cabinets down below and probably another coat up here on these, close those holes out, because she wants different um, fixtures on there. It's looking good, looking real good. That's gonna be nice. And then the backsplash, we'll do a renter friendly, just white or cream, um, either contact paper or the little peel and stick tiles. And that's it, that's all. And then this is how I stage the, um, what do you call this, the island. But you can see like right here, it gives you an idea kind of what it's going to look like. She's going for that vibe right here. Green, dark green like this, like the faux butcher countertops, a lot of natural woodsy green, stuff like that. Um, here is what this is looking like. Curtains are hung and then that. And here's how the girls room turned out with the flowers, the sheer on top, Solar and um, Noble. But look at the sleeping bags. Oh, they're so cute. They can just lounge right here and watch TV. And then there's the little curtains right there. So cute. She still has the lights up in there so she can turn the lights on and it's just like a whole little vibe. She know that I wanna be good for you. She know that I wanna be good for you, I do. But sometimes someone was bad for me. Sometimes someone was bad, or oh, can't you see? I'm just being weak. Mm -hmm. I think you know that I care for you. I think you know that I care for you, I do But sometimes I can't be there for me Sometimes I can't be there, baby, can't you see That I'm just being me mm. Sometimes we're just colliding And we keep on fighting But we'll be okay, cause we got Unconditional love Sometimes we're just crying But we'll keep on trying I know we'll be okay Cause we got unconditional love Sam, I don't wanna be mad on you No, I don't wanna be mad on things you do But sometimes I need what's best for me Sometimes I need what's best Baby, can't you see? Can't be there when you weak No, no, no Yes, I want you to be here for me Of course I want you to be here Don't disappear Sometimes 
Sometimes I need you strong for me Sometimes I need you strong when I'm on my knees Oh baby please You know it's there and even if we don't agree You know I can't cause baby you and me We meant to be It's you and me Unconditional La ha 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 You and me Unconditional love Sometimes we just colliding And we keep on fighting But we'll be okay Cause we got unconditional love Sometimes we just crying But we'll keep on trying I know we'll be okay Cause we got unconditional love
been just picking up, picking up, picking up, picking up, picking up, picking up with you. Think about how can I, how can I, how can I, how can I, how can I keep you? I've been just picking up, picking up, picking up, picking up, picking up with you. Think about how can I, how can I, how can I, how can I, how can I keep you? Hey, I'm just a go, how can I tell you been going through my phone? My dad buy, I got Bobby in Jude, I don't know how long, yeah. You and I, not like God, cause we flying for my brothers. Bobby, yeah, I got problems popping bottles. Yo, she had my dick, I told you. Nigga, me and Honda got, I'm sorry about my mind too. Then I just think I'm not gonna do my cook for a while. Don't you ever say goodbye. So it's a own in the mind. Yeah, pony, she more lie. Take a bite you all the time. Baby, I put you in my job tonight. Yeah, trying to have a ship for now. I've been sipping on the rocks. On the wine, let's just ride the light. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've just picking up, 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 to record there is a siren okay i realized i didn't tell y'all where everything was from so all these big cream knitted pillows right here it's three of them all of these are from target these right here these ones came with the comforter okay and these two are from Home Goods. Well, actually, all of these are from Home Goods. Those two in the center. This one. And then the two solids. The comforter is from Target. Quilt Target. This beautiful throw, which is huge. Target. That throw, Target. That pillow, I already had it, but it's from Home Goods, and you can reverse it. So I can even do the neutral on that side, or I can play with pattern over here because I like pattern and I like to mix pattern. I'll keep it on that side for a little subtleness, razzle dazzle over there. And these oh my goodness let me turn the light on they deserve first of all i don't know if you can tell the size of this but this is big target target let me show you the price of this vase this vase looks so expensive to me where is the price look at this i don't even know that You see that? Is it focusing? Focus. Focus, Linda. Well, hopefully you can see that price. $29.99. This is beautiful. And it's heavy. It's heavy. She's worth it. Okay. The smaller one. Let me show you. Run, don't walk now. Look at that. $24.99. I was stunned. What brand is this? Let's see. Does it tell you? Um. Oh, the Hearth, the Hearth and Home. Trying to gains. I was very surprised at the price of these. Be beautiful, amazing quality. Looks so expensive. So we just added that over here just to brighten up this little corner and change out the vases. But this is my old neutral winter room. Just all about the creams, the tone on tones, the softness, the... <sighs> I just want to get back into bed right now. But I also want to stand here and enjoy how pretty it is. Oh, the lamps. Lamps and shades. Target as well. 
I'll show you what the lamp looks like. Beautiful. Just beautiful. And then the shade. Brought in a different little texture. A little linen shade. With some pleated details. So pretty. So pretty. And I don't know if you know this, but those nightstands were thrifted. And they are literally heavier than a car. <laughs> The top of them, I think, is literally made out of cement. The, the base of them. I don't know that I'll ever get rid of these because they're oversized. And they're perfect for a large size bedroom. But they're thrifted. And they were ugly brown when I initially bought them. If you remember that, leave me a comment down below when you remember the purchase of those.